It's time of year when haunted house attractions are hiring in preparation for spooky season. Kate Williams, Lonnie Walton visited one in Webb City and learned they're about more than just the screen. A lot. We have people that get scared in the first room and they chicken out, so we have a lot of chicken exits. Um, we have uh, all different kinds of uh, mazes with different characters, so anywhere you go, you never know where one, a character's lurking. So they're screaming all the way through till the very end. Maddie Idris is the owner of Unleashed Hunt. However, it's not your typical haunted house. While the screams are plenty, so is the gift back to the community. We donate to various different organizations. The Humane Society is one we always give, um, you know, we try to give a donation to. Um, I'm actually partnering with the Web City Theater Department. They're coming out and acting, and in return, I'm going to give them a donation to their school program. Um, and then various cancer organizations, Special Olympics, we're actually doing the Polar Plunge. Etris and the Hunted House actors make sure fun is endured by all. Kids or someone who's scared, if they want to go through and see everything, we give them a, a, um, a neon light and we take them through with a flashlight. And none of my actors will scare them. If you really want to get spooked, watch out. We have an experience for everybody, but we also are really scary and will make people um, pee their pants or pass out. So, yeah. Reporting in Web City, I'm Lonnie Walton, KOAM News. Unleashed Taunt opens this weekend for anyone ready to get into the spooky season spirit. If you